hi my dear friends today you are going to learn about uh, tn vat vat e filing go to google search tn vat or www.tnvat.gov.in .in. after that uh, you can see this screen if your company is in Coimbatore or Salem dealers click this or Chennai and other divisions click this you click second one after that login details will ask login details will ask username here enter your company TIN number and password if you don't have login password then you can click this sign up after you login this screen will appear first one is monthly returns that means see last month you are going to send the uh, send uh, returns for e filing click this this is form 1 annexer annexers upload this is VAT reports VAT reports means last month a uh, two year two months back reports whatever the old reports we can get from this and next one is after you click this one monthly returns the screen will appear like this click here for VAT return click here for CST that is form 1 say VAT return form I click submit the screen will appear like this say here fill the fill your sales here uh, your uh, VAT purchase details here your VAT sales details then payment details give the payment details then here form 1 payment details see like this amount wa what is the amount you have to pay and uh, check cl click here check or cash then here date name of bank branch code then check number then save it this is upload an excel <coughs> this is very important upload annexer means sales details and purchase details they are having uh, four uh, annexer that is uh, annexer one annexer one for purchase annexer two for sale annexer three for uh, returns and uh, this is uh, what you call uh, stock transfers uh, stock transfers annexer 3 also used for uh, input tax reversal actually this is 2010 version this is file this is not correct here in this only one file has to upload at present four files has to upload four annexers so here uh, what is this annexer one this is purchase details local purchase details here enter the tin number party number party name will comes here automatically then the commodity code here the commodity code number product name will display here invoice number Inv each invoice was you have to enter one by one by one entering invoice date and purchase value rate of tax amount then save it like that you have to enter one by one say your company sale invoice total for month is not more than 20 entries you can enter one by one like this if your sales turnover uh, turn uh, sales invoices more than 100 or 50 better to go for uh, an extra upload that means this uh, you know that uh, annexers format will uh, here 
Annexer file will uh, available on the website. You can download and fill and then upload. See here, browse where is the file situation. Just uh, click this and upload. See here, uh, a download Excel sheet. If you download, uh, you can, it is available of uh, four uh, annexers, four five annexers. And one more thing now the cell tax as Spain added one more annexer that is for uh, annexer 1a that is for interstate purchase interstate purchase you have to fill in an uh, annexer 1a that is for to get uh, C form from website through online then here this is annexer 1 okay already I have discussed uh, then here annexer 2 this is the sales details okay annexer 3 see here annexer 1 annexer 2 annexer 3 like this annexer 2 is sales you fill the details like this this is annexer 3 details of reversal input credit during the month that means when you stock transfer to other branches say you were admin office in Chennai you have a branch in Bangalore Karnataka so you will transfer stock for uh, 1 lakh 2 lakh whatever it is that uh, that 1 lakh uh, amount input tax you have to reverse that means you can't claim that uh, input tax then zero rate this is for export uh, export sale after finishing everything click here to confirm this is actually 2010 version this is here annexer 1 annexer 2 annexer 3 annexer 4 now tnvat has been updated one more uh, annexer that is 1a that is for CST purchase after everything you have filled successfully say here confirm before confirm your returns please be sure that everything is paka once you confirm this you can't edit you can't alter that's it thanks for watching my video